Yikes, America, so it's happened, huh? Are you guys really keeping and paying attention? Well, I really hope you are. I mean, I am who I say I am. I'm uh, Solar Max Benjamin Teachout out here in DeSoto, Iowa, and uh, running this site uh, to keep you guys informed and to uh, document events as they happen. So if you need to utilize my site as resources, go right ahead. Uh, except these sites uh, have their own archives. You can go up and uh, take a look at them. But now we have a solar flare alert. Okay, uh, this is something uh, that's well and it was a sustained X class flare. Okay, uh, we got a major flare detected. It's a X 1.2. It was off of the region that we've been warning you about. Here's your solar global absorption layer. We can uh, experience even some blackouts. Uh, especially up here in the Northern Territories. Uh, even here in the United States, uh, we're going to have some transmission problems when it comes to the uh, satellite communications. Um, sorry about the audio here. I'll just go ahead and mute that out on my TV. Um, uh, but this are, uh, these are the initial reports uh, that are out. Uh, we're going to want to uh, actually come out and take a look at this uh, later on, but even here, uh, in the 5 megahertz range, let's go up to the 15s, okay, so we, we're talking some uh, real major storming that's going to happen as a result of this, this spiral is going to take a while to update, but this is just happening, folks, X-Class Flare Event 1.2, Earth Directed, okay, uh, we got a, uh, the solar flux hasn't changed that much, except over here, the 245 range, we got the BZ that's already at a negative 1.3, uh, solar wind right now is at a minimal, uh, but you know we're taking some pretty good shock from this over here. Uh, so this X 1.2 flare, folks, from 1944, and they said uh, 1943. Uh, do you even see that anywhere on the disc? All right, let's see. What? Now, there's also radio emissions uh, that are associated with this. We can see the departure over here on the BZ. This is very important. And we're going to have a ramping of the solar wind uh, probably uh, on this. Temperature is going right along with it. This is a sudden impulse. Okay, guys, the sudden impulse. This is what we're getting immediately after that flare. Okay. And, uh, and we're already having some good strong M's before that. And uh, this sunspot continues to grow even, okay, beta gamma delta. Uh, so it's very important that you uh, keep a look at this. You wonder why your lights go out, okay? Check out those magne magnometers. Uh, <laughs> uh, ain't no hiding this one when it when uh, it spikes way up like this. Can you imagine if it went backwards? <laughs> Oh, that would be funny. Anyway, uh, that was just a joke, guys. But uh, this is nothing to laugh at. Um, this site immediately has uh, updated this to uh, uh, X 1.9, close to 1.2. This is not over with, folks. And I wanted you to pay close attention to the magnetics on this, okay? There's one thing that doesn't go with the other here, okay? What is wrong with this picture? I want you to pay close attention. What is wrong with this picture? Okay, this is one of the reasons why I want to show you. You see the blue leading the red, and out here you got the red leading the blue. Okay, this is due to the 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 uh, to the polar shift, I believe, or the polar shift. <laughs> got that polar vortex on my mind. Oh, that, that's a ridiculous statement they ever came out with one. But anyway, we're talking about the magnetic uh, pole shifting uh, here on the sun, and this is a good sign of the that it's not complete. Uh, but these two groupings together is very, very dangerous. Let's uh, go ahead and uh, you know you can see a picture uh, right here of the mixing here. Uh, and like I said, it doesn't take an X, but this is right at us. Uh, what what's going to happen? Uh, it's really hard to tell. Uh, here's your uh, two-hour data, uh, and when the pulse is having noticed a dip in the wind, okay, and then a spike in the wind, okay, over here dip and then recovery, then a spike over here in the density, spike over here in the density, and we have this major departure here too on the BZ. Uh, so when it comes to this proton storming, uh, etc., we gotta really keep a a close eye. Uh, that BZ uh, departure uh, is something to worry about as well. 
uh, that could really do some frying. Uh, but please keep attention, guys. Uh, X class flare alert. And uh, this thing is not over with. God bless you.